Hi and welcome to changetheworld.com. I'm Arun Kumar and I'm here to teach you about the Adobe Photoshop CS2 application. Now Adobe Photoshop is actually used to edit images or make or create designs. So for the beginners, uh, initially I would be walking you through downloading the software and installing it on your computer. So let's begin. Let me open up the browser and search for Adobe Photoshop CS2 tryout version. Alright, so let me select the first link here. And I have a page wherein I can download the trial version, the tryout version, which is for 30 days. And click on this download link here. And then save the file on your local hard drive. I've already uh, saved the file so I need not save it once again so let me go ahead and cancel and then let me close this window or just log on to Google right so let me open up the folder and here is the setup option usually when you download the file it would be in uh, WinRAR it would be compressed so make sure you have a WinRAR software installed on your computer and unzip all the files and you would get this setup file so let me go ahead and double click on it you can choose the language let me select American English and click OK accept and then let me click on install Photoshop CS2 let me click next now let me accept the license if you want you can go ahead and read the license and click accept now here you'll have to choose the 30-day trial version or if you have purchased a license a serial number from Adobe Photoshop or Adobe you can always type it in here and click next let me rename this as training and change the organization to change dot com alright and this is the website where I post all the tutorials let me click next and if you want you can change the location for the installation I can either uh, give it D or E De it depends on the space available on your C drive or D drive I have enough, enough space on C drive so let me click OK and click next and let me click next again again install it would take some time and additionally it would install uh, two additional applications that is Adobe Bridge which is uh, useful to browse the images or folders on your computer alright so it's installing the Adobe Bridge application
right so it's done let me click finish and close so in the next tutorial I would be teaching you about the uh, tools available in Adobe Photoshop CS2 and their functionalities there are much more tutorials to come and uh, I've estimated about uh, 18 to 20 tutorials so see you in the next tutorial bye now